Well, uh, I recently showed you a copy of Hendrix in the West, and uh, I had had a look alongside it and discovered that I'd got this title, which is just that, just Jackie, the Cry of Love. Uh, this was from 1971. Interesting illustration there. This isn't uh, this isn't the original copy that I had because, as I explained in the other video, I had to rebuy certain ones. Strangely enough, I haven't got this on CD, which I, I thought I had, but no, don't seem to. Um, it's got freedom drifting easy rider nightbird flying great track that my friend straight ahead astro man angel in from the storm and belly button window and it opens out like there's some nice photographs uh that's uh that looks like a shop on this one here looks like a shop from rainbow bridge and uh the other shot on the other side is Jimmy at uh, Monterey setting fire to his guitar so they've used a couple of odds and ends photographs um, it, uh, this edition is manufactured by Polydor Records design and photography of Victor Kahn uh, Sunshine Illustration and Nancy Reiner um, Special thanks to the following people for participating in this album. Mitch Mitchell on drums, Billy Cox on bass, The Ghetto Fighters background vocals in Freedom, Buzzling Heart, Vibes in Drifting, Steve Winwood and Chris Wood, Vibes in Easy Rider, uh, Buddy Miles drums, uh, Buddy Miles drums on Easy Rider, uh, so on and so forth. And uh, there's a little bit there, uh, Jimi Hendrix on the back. Um, this was an album that used to get played a lot in Mosley Village back in about 71. Uh, and uh, a lot of people used to drop acid and, uh, um, well, they'd put it on the turntable beforehand and they'd sort of be out the minds and... Uh, claiming that they're seeing all sorts of things and that the uh, the illustration here of Jimmy was coming to life and he was making various facial expressions all a whole load of blooming nonsense but still there you go part of the wondrous 60s 70s experience this is definitely worth an album worth picking up to have a listen to um, but like I said, I was amazed that I haven't got this on CD, so I'll have to do something about that anyway. But uh, maybe you own a copy of this yourself. I think, I think my original copy was bought from a record shop in St Mary's Row in Mosley Village in Birmingham. And uh, that's where I bought several of the Hendrix bits and bobs from. Anyhow, hope you liked seeing this. Please click a like if you have. And uh, see about subscribing if you want to. Who knows? Big help. But still, there it is. I don't think I'll be framing this copy though. Okay, thanks for dropping by and watching this video. Bye for now.